What's up, Wayne Baron here with uh, DarkEffects.net, and we are inside of Adobe Edge Animate, and it's been a little while since I've done anything within Edge, and uh, well, I just found something today that I've been hunting for for a while, and it is by I don't know how to pronounce his name. I'll put his link down in the description. It's P I O T R, and uh, he's got a tutorial called Edge Animate Animating Over a Curved Path. And his curve path, basically, he has a ball that bounces. It comes out, goes down, and then goes back up. So I want to add a little uh, trick to it to make it just a little bit better than what he has on his. Uh, let's get rid of our lessons over here. And what I'm going to do with mine is that I'm actually going to have mine come out from here. Squish then go out. So let's go ahead and get our ball and let's make it uh, a red. First thing we want to do is we want our XY origin keyframe, our rotation keyframe, our Y and X axis. Okay now come up here and choose the transform tool or hit Q on your keypad and right down here in the middle, or right in the middle, not down, but in the middle, grab a hold of it, pull it down to here. Now, what you want to do is double click, drag it to the one second mark. If you grab a hold of it in the middle, you will move your marker here. So what you do is you run your cursor to the edge, and as you can see, there is an arrow that sort of circle. You want to click there and then drag. Bring it right to the edge and then uh, let's see here we want to go ahead and get our squishy. All right that's our keyframe so then we drag it about up in here and then we squish it down and we started out with a 99 so then we go to here then we change this back to 99 and then we double click out of here and we create a keyframe here here and here yeah there okay now what we want to do is uncheck both of them grab a hold of our little eye thing whatever it's called drag it to this side, double click, drag this to about up in here, put your cursor to the side and you see your little circular arrow, and drag your ball out. And with the animation run, it should get right up in here and squish down, and it should have a delay, squish down and then go back up. So let's check it out. Pretty cool, huh? Squish down, jumps back up. I like that. That's pretty cool. So, uh, I give kudos once again to P-I-O-T-R. Sorry, I cannot pronounce your name. And uh, But adding that squishy effect right there at the bottom really sells the animation. Just having the ball come in and not have that squish down effect doesn't really sell it. So having that squish down effect really sells this animation pretty well. So alright, this is Wayne Barron with DarkFix.net. Y'all have a rocking week and uh, keep on animating. Bye bye.